to see a story about one family and how they live together. About Tony and his dog Fluffy. About his sister Nancy. About mother who takes good care of the whole family. And about father who works hard for his family. Our story begins one afternoon after school. Tony has been outside playing with Fluffy. Now he can hardly wait to get off his boots to tell his mother something. Mother, mother, he cries. Look what the mailman brought. Movies, movies of us. Oh, yes, Tony, the pictures father took. Mother, could we see them tonight? Oh, I'm afraid not, Tony. Dinner will be late tonight, Mother said, because Nancy can't help me. She's taking her music lesson. And after dinner and the dishes, it'll be time for bed. Well, it's too bad not to see the pictures tonight. These are Tony's hooks. Father made this place for wraps so the children can help keep the house neat. It's Tony's job to keep Fluffy's things put away, too. It's time for him to prepare Fluffy's supper. That's another one of his regular jobs. Well, Tony works preparing the dog food just as he does every evening. But he's thinking, all oh, late dinner tonight. No chance for fun together before bedtime. But maybe if things go right. Here, Fluffy, Tony calls. Good old Fluffy, want your supper? Stand up for it. But suddenly, Tony stops playing. Look at the dirt from Fluffy's muddy paws. And Tony's mother. She, too, is unhappy about those muddy paws because see what Fluffy has done to the clean kitchen floor. Oh, my, my, such a dirty floor. By the time Mother cleans that up, dinner will be even later. Now there'll be no time to see the movies together. Mother is sorry. Oh, that's too bad. What could Tony do? What would you do? Mother! Tony says, if I wipe the floor and help you get dinner the way Nancy does, do you think dinner would be early enough to see the movies together? Oh, maybe. Tony gets busy right away. Maybe if he does some extra work helping his mother, maybe dinner will not be so late after all. And if father gets home on time... Then Tony looks at Fluffy's paws and he thinks, Wish you wore boots, Fluffy. But I'll wipe your paws anyway so you won't track up the kitchen anymore and make dinner late. Then as Tony washes his hands, he says, Mother, could I help with dinner? I could shell the rest of the peas. Mother thanks Tony for helping with the floor and brings over the bag of peas. So Tony and his mother are busy getting dinner. Working together is fun. And you get more done. Have you ever done this? Well, the time seems to go fast as Tony and his mother work together. Now, let's look in the dining room to see... Well, here's Nancy, home from her music lesson. And she's setting the table. This is one of her regular jobs. She likes arranging a pretty table for the whole family to enjoy during dinner. Then, before long, the table's all set, ready for dinner. And out in the kitchen, the dinner's all ready to set on the table. And Mother says, We'll be ready to eat as soon as Father comes home. My, I hope he's not late, don't you? And here's Father now, coming home from his daily work. Hello, Nancy, how are you tonight, Father says. Then he calls out, hello, everybody in the kitchen. And oh, is Tony happy. 
father's home, dinner's ready. There's time, isn't there, Mother? There's time. Yes, Tony, says Mother. There's time. Hi, look what came, look what came, the movies we took, Tony shouts. And Father says, that's fine. Pictures of shoveling snow and what else? Shall we see them after dinner? How soon do we eat? Right now, says Mother, as soon as you're ready. And so they all work together to get dinner on the table. But even though they're thinking about their fun together after dinner, they're not going to hurry through the meal itself. They make sure that everything is on the table in just the right place. They take time to pray together, giving thanks for their meal. Dinner time is happy time for this family. They talk about the good things that happen each day, sharing their fun with each other. Nancy tells of something pleasant that her music teacher said today. Mother says how helpful Tony was this afternoon. Tony tells of a new trick that Fluffy learned. Father tells of helping a man whose hat blew off and went sailing down the windy street. Well, now dinner is finished and Mother and Nancy are working together washing and drying the dishes. Here comes Father with the last things from the table. Tony works with his father helping